Good morning. It's another great day in Bangkok to go out and do what you want to do. Yeah, okay, it's not morning when I'm shooting this, but it was this morning when I got up and I thought I'd insert that little clip in there to open the video with. Because I am making a video about doing what I want to do. I'm here at Siam Square, fancy uh, mall in Bangkok. And I'm here to, uh, to make a short video, a TikTok video with my new favorite model, Cake. And I thought I would talk a little bit about stuff that I said in my last video. I was talking about how um, things are changing in the world of, uh, of, of media and, and YouTube advertising. And that it's a really bad time, I think, to be uh, trying to make a living out of YouTube or trying to make money out of, uh, out of YouTube. And I've never made any anyway. But I've always been influenced by, you know, the numbers game. You know, do this, do that, make your thumbnails this way, follow along with all, what all the creators are telling you to do. And that, that's not really what I want to do. I want to do my own stuff. And because I really think that in the upcoming months, it's going to be a really bad idea to be trying to make money with YouTube anyway. That's freed me up from even considering that stuff. I'm just going to do what I want to do. And I'm walking into an area where they're playing Jimi Hendrix movie uh, music saying, let me stand next to your fire. Yeah, that'll get me a copyright hit. But move over, Rover, let Charlie take over. So what they got, Miss Book out. Yeah, Jimmy's still singing, let me stand next to your fire as my model walks up. I hope we don't get blasted out on copyright stuff. So yeah, this uh, Siam Square is one of the fancier of the many fancy malls that you find around Bangkok. And I thought it would be a good place for the short video that I'm making. No shortage. Of photographic targets here. <laughs> the ever vigilant boa cow tells me that that lady in the white shirt over there is checking me out. You think? Jing <laughs> Law? <laughs> I keep calling it Siam Square. It's actually Siam Center is the proper name for the for the plaza here. And one of the reasons I like about it is because the way it's constructed, it gives you like an early sunset, you know, a faux golden hour, if you will. And there's plenty of visual stuff to capture here for making videos. And the water, the fountain, might drown out the Jimi Hendrix music that is still pumping out in the background like crazy. Yeah, I hope YouTube doesn't cancel this out on me. But at any rate, about YouTube, you know, I've been drawn down the road of creators, uh, you know, making videos on YouTube, trying sometimes to maximize my views and, and, and the other statistics that they use to measure the success of content. And I've always complained along the way about how that sometimes interferes with creativity. You know, and I'm doing this because I like to do it. I have the advantage of never having made money off YouTube, so I'm not giving anything up. But also, you know, this notion that advertising revenue is down, and I really believe that it is, and it's, you know, getting more and more difficult to make anything out of YouTube. I, you know, you know who Charles Bukowski is? Charles Bukowski has become like a grassroots cult, cult philosopher from the United States. 
In reality, Charles Bukowski worked for the United States Post Office, was a raving alcoholic and totally depressed, but there was something colorful in his Debbie Downer philosophy, and I'm going to use a little bit of it here. Well, let's go back even further than Bukowski. I guess Janis Joplin used it in uh, that song she sang way back when. Freedom is having nothing else to lose or something like that. So yeah, as far as YouTube is concerned, I have nothing to lose. So I'm just going to do stuff that I like to do. Hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know what they're going to look like going forward because I'm no longer paying attention to the suggested parameters. I'm just going to put shit up that I like. Yeah, well, ending the photo shoot with a flourish here. High style.